So here's the thing. We have five dogs right now. Jolene, how are you? Jolene is here for a whole week. Uh, we are very lucky to have her. She's one of my favorite dogs in the whole world. She's also very easy to watch and she's been coming here since she was a puppy. So with the exception of Bunny, she's only met Bunny once before I think, but with our dogs, the other ones, she's really comfortable. So she's very easy to watch. But Bunny right now, um, we talked about on our podcast, she was walking in the backyard. There was a piece of metal, like, I don't know, gardening equipment or a part of the fence or something was on the ground. And she stepped and cut in between her toes and she had to get a couple stitches. So poor Foof is injured. <laughs> she has a sock on it right now to try and keep her from getting at those stitches. She cannot wear a cone because she is way too skittish for it. She actually like freaked out a couple times before we finally decided that supervision and a muzzle and or just pure supervision with a sock is probably our best option for her. So we are a little bit housebound right now because we're basically playing dog kennel. Am I right? Our dreams are coming true. So what I wanted to do today was just something kind of fun. You know, like when you're a little kid and your foot is hurt and all you want to do is go outside and play and you can't really she's not supposed to run or walk really a lot on it so i'm trying to just entertain them and i'm trying to entertain jolene as well show her that this is a fun place to stay something i wanted to do all summer but never did like i made a video a while ago about making homemade dog treats for my dogs and a lot of the pinterest posts were like if you freeze this and then tie it from a string and tie it to a tree or something like that you have like this fun little popsicle for your dog. So I've been meaning to do fun popsicles all summer long. And today just felt like the perfect day to have some nice, calm popsicle time. I definitely want to do something for her so that she can have something fun. It doesn't require a lot of exercise or moving her foot a lot. And so we made some popsicles. There are so many recipes on Pinterest. They range from chicken broth, beef broth, baby food, all kinds of fruits, yogurt, peanut butter. But the one that I decided to do was a watermelon and coconut milk recipe. You essentially take about a quarter of a watermelon and you can either put it in a mixing bowl or I chose to put it in a Vitamix blender. And the first thing you're gonna do is make sure that there are no seeds in it. I think some of the white seeds are fine if you don't get all of them, but you're mostly just looking for getting rid of any of the black traditional watermelon seeds so not good for dogs or people so stop eating them then i'm taking an entire can of coconut milk and putting it in to the blender as well blending that up really quick super easy everything with a mouth in the entire universe likes watermelon so hopefully my dogs like this otherwise i'm gonna be pissed why did i do this i could have just eaten this watermelon myself y'all are ungrateful and i'm pouring it into an ice cube tray you could use anything like an actual popsicle mold or whatever you want for a stick so that we can tie them we're using greenies because it's actual crack to all of the dogs they all love them i don't know what else to say it's their favorite thing that exists. And then I did make some without any for marble or for extras. I basically just want farm animals in my backyard. You know, like when you, you hang up stuff for your goats and your sheep and your cows and your horses. I want that, but with dogs. We did that earlier today so that they could be nice and frozen when it wasn't like pure beaming sunshine out. You could have some shade for them to eat it in. Also, disclaimer, if you're not here for chill dog popsicle content, I don't know why you would have clicked on this video, but that's exactly what it is though. So. Hope you're in for a good time. Bye, Foo. Hi, baby. Hi, honey. Are you chilling? Yeah. Oh God, that was a bee. Flew straight into our house. That's great. I hope it builds a whole nest in there. Let's go. I've been in the freezer for a while. I don't really know exactly how long. Oh, that's perfect. It's definitely frozen enough. I mean, Bunny's probably gonna have no problem eating around this string, but for some of the littles, you might have to cut this off for them to get the rest of it. But Peachy, I wanna see your little butt go absolutely nuts for a greenie on his day. I'm interested to see if they eat the watermelon part or just try and get the greenie out. I'm gonna leave these here. Foof is gonna go first because this is essentially for Foof, although also Jolene because she's a guest and we want her to like us and think that we have a normal home where we just make popsicles all the time, which is what I do every day. I wake up and make popsicles, whoa. I feel like this is a good spot because 
if she pulls on it, it's not like it's gonna come down or anything. How low do you think it should be like that? I don't want her to have to reach up too high. Actually, a little lower, because you don't want her to stand on her hind legs. I mean, have you seen her? She's a horse. Yeah, she is pretty big. Here you go. It's the popsicle. So I've just had the barnyard treat. Fluffy Ray! Honey, look! Look, honey! What's that? What's that, baby? That's for you! Yeah, it's for you! Oh! <laughs> Is that good? Oh, all the dogs are freaking out right now. Is that fun? Huh? Popsicle! Oh! Yummy! <laughs> is that fun? It's making her so orange. Oh, is that good, honey? They are the biggest babies. I know, can you hear them? Can Bunny not just like enjoy herself for a little bit? Good girl, honey. You're right, you said she was gonna grab it. Grab it, honey. You can do it. She's still a little like too nervous to fully eat it off the string. She's just trying to get the string. And this is why I wanted a strong branch. <laughs> Good girl, you can figure it out. Yeah, you gotta bite it. Which do you... <laughs> oh, is that cold? Look, your whole mouth is orange. I know. Your whole mouth orange. Yes, that good girl. She's like, oh, it's mine. I got it. You're gonna have to bite it. You're gonna have to bite it, honey. You gotta use your teeth. Oh, oh buddy. She just wants the greenie. There you go. There you go, baby. There you go. Good girl. Good girl. She's so smart. You want some orange? She's so smart. Wow, ignoring the popsicle, I see. Well, I would say uh, low on the entertainment scale. I mean, we probably could have just given her a greenie. <laughs> And she would have been just as happy. All right, we're gonna uh, muzzle Foo so she doesn't get at her sock. We're gonna set up a, a nice four small dog setup. Actually, does Marble even need one? No. He's, he's gonna not, be way too scared. He's not gonna get it out of the air. It's gonna be a three dog setup with one on the ground for Marbles. Okay. Oh, she's back. Oh, does she want the popsicle now? I think she just wants more greenie. She's like, is this the greenie tree? Do they grow here? Oh, good girl. Good girl. Oh, she's eating the whole thing now. Well, we know that you like watermelon. Oh, she really likes it. Got a nice treat, honey. Oh, that is disgusting. Nice to meet you. Don't do I swear to God. Nice to meet you. Shake my hand. I don't want to shake your hand. Thank no. you for doing business with me, sir. <laughs> All in the day's work. I'm gonna tie the. It's a safe place to stash your scissors if you're ever outside using scissors. Whatever you're doing, stop. Whatever you're doing, just stop it. Take them a little deeper. Why are you leaving the scissors staked into the ground like that? That's the safest place to store them. Brilliant. And convenient. Poperino and cheese, you have to go inside, my baby. Time to go inside, Popsicle Girl. <laughs> we're gonna have to move fast. These are like melting. I think I got three that were okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, I broke that one. Oh. <laughs> Wait, this one's just a greenie on his tree. Peach, not yet, not yet. These are all melting. So, Jolie. <laughs> Jolene's might just be on the ground, honestly, because I can't get a third one to not fall apart. Here. Okay, Marble, do you want one? Here, Marble. Marble, come over here. Peachy, good girl. Here, Marble. Kermit, Kermit. Oh, it's all over his neck. Kermit, here, honey. Okay, you guys, there you go. There it is. Peachy, wait, you can have your own. Here you go. Jolene, do you want one? Just give Jolene hers. Marble, this is the challenge of your lifetime. Here. Peach, don't go for the tray. Oh. This is a shit show. There you go, Jolene. Kermit, why are you looking in the ground? Marble, what happened to yours? <gasps> did someone steal marbles? Oh, Marble. Oh, did someone steal your popsicle, honey? Here. Wait, why is no one going for them? Because they're not quite sure what's going on. Wait, where did you come from? Wait, come on. 
Kermit! Hey! Kermit, drop Kermit! Drop the greenie, Kermit! Kermit, that's not your green. Kermit! Kermit, you can't take that from the ice tray. Drop Kermit, drop the greenie. He stole it from the ice tray. <laughs> that's not how the game works. Okay, this is not the first. Wait, Peach took a greenie too. Peach? They're just stealing greenies. Oh my god, it's dripping on Kermit's neck. <laughs> Guys, the game is you gotta get him. There we go. Please. Good boy, good boy. Please. Do you wanna try, honey? Look, Joey. It's getting more on the Look, back Joey. of Kermit's head than in his mouth. Oh, Joey likes it. Oh, otter, my. Otter. Good girl, Joey. Get it. Good girl. Is it good? Huh? <laughs> Bless you. Marble doesn't know what to do. Marble, it's right in front of you. It is all Here. over the back of Kermit's head. I know, it's disgusting. Good girl, Jolene. Get it, honey. Meanwhile, Peach is back there. She just stole an entire greenie. Not playing the popsicle game at all. Oh, our one actual participant, Jolene. Oh, she keeps knocking it in the Is everyone going to need a bath after this? Like they're gonna be all sticky. Jolene's like the the nice girl that stays at someone else's house and is like, this is so good. Thank you so much for making this for me. You got it, Jolene. Get it, baby. <laughs> Peachy, you wanna try? Here, honey. Wow, the smartest dog here. Get it, Peachy. Good girl. Oh shit. <laughs> baby, baby girl, be careful. Oh god, I didn't tie it that tight. Wait, Peach. Peach, it's just like a. Oh. Oh my god. She got it like all over herself. Marble is just quietly enjoying his popsicle in the grass. Peach, <laughs> Peach, Peach. Oh, Kermit. Peach. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you like hurt or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Do I have to put a warning on this video? Like, that is the grossest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> the whole string off! No, she didn't. She's got the whole string! Oh my god, she ripped the string! I'm like actually crying. It was so funny. He's like covered in it. Look at Marble licking sideways. Oh. Is that fun, Marble? Nice summer tree. Oh, baby. Jolene, you're the only one that actually appreciated it and did it the right way. You're such a good girl. Are you having fun at our house? Look how clean she is, too. Like, it's nowhere on her. She actually did it the right way. Unlike some people. Yeah. Jolene, you're such a good girl. Well, you tell this them. Was something. I'm like crying. Peach. Peachy girl. The good news is that we didn't really spend a lot of time, like, making them. It's not an intense recipe, that's for sure. But tying them up before they melt is definitely a challenge. And the dogs really like them. No one really actually participated in my game, except for Jolene, because she's a sweet angel that appreciates staying at our house. Yeah. Well, oh. Hey. <laughs> oh, Kermit just snaked Marble. Oh, Marble, no, honey. Oh, Bobby, come here. I know, that was mean, huh? Yeah, he stole that from me. Okay, you can have one more little piece up here. Kermit, you should not have stole that. How does it taste? It actually does taste really good. Does it? Yeah, because it's just like almost like a watermelon creamsicle. Yeah. Why are you covered in it? Oh, Jolene. Is that good? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, thanks. It's fun here. Was that good, honey? Okay, we should probably take it easy on the watermelon. Make sure that no one gets too much because if they have too much watermelon, they'll get diarrhea. God, he's so nasty. He's gonna need a bath. He's covered in it. Oh, yes, honey. Is that good? Kerm.
Well, that was messy. It was sticky. It was fun. Did you guys have a good time? Does everyone say thank you or y'all just don't care about me at all? Well, it was a little bit of a mess. It definitely didn't go as we had planned, but that didn't matter because I think all of you guys enjoyed yourself. Are you still looking for more? There is no more. Jolene, thank you for being here. Thank you for participating in a way that made any sense whatsoever. Kermit, I have no idea how you got popsicle all over the back of your head, but congratulations. Did you have fun? Was that fun? Even though Kermit stole your popsicle, did you have a good time? Peach had a great time. She's, she just had her own picnic. She just, she's going back over there to see if there's anything left. I mean, at this point, we're gonna have to bring them inside. That whole sticky, like, watermelon smell is gonna attract bees. We all know what happens when we step on bees, don't we, Kermit? Yeah, your head's probably itchy, huh? He's gonna attract bees. <laughs> I mean, there's so many recipes for dog popsicles. You can make it out of just like anything that's safe for dogs, pretty much, that freezes. It's definitely fun and worth it. Like, I cried laughing at Kermit, so I would say it's worth it. He needs a bath. But yeah, that's it for this week. So I hope that you enjoyed dog eating popsicle content. For those of you that are gonna ask what kind of dog Jolene is, she's a chug. She's a chihuahua pug. Thank you for staying with us and being such a good girl. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put on new videos every Wednesday slash Thursday. And uh, thanks for letting me make a chill dog video this week because we are in Dog Watch 2K19. Dog pops. Me lady. Me lady. Okay, why are you doing that? Kermit, there is no more. All right, we have to get him inside. He's gonna attract bees. Let's go.